Welcome to this week's Lit Family video with the Davis family. And here's our story. This week's gospel is our Lord's Passion. It's Palm Sunday, the week before Easter. The Mass, where everybody says, here comes the long gospel. And if you have young children, it's that silent, is this ever going to end? It's an opportunity for us to walk with Jesus in his passion. The Last Supper, the Eucharist, our opportunity to be one with our Lord and Savior by receiving him body and blood, soul and divinity at Mass. We have Judas portraying Jesus for 30 pieces of silver. We have Judas kissing him on the cheek to mark him as the person they need to take. How many times in our lives have we been Judas? Yet Christ still loves us. Christ still forgives us. We think about Peter, who said to Jesus, I would never deny you. And he does it once, twice, three times, just as Jesus said. We think about the crowd as Jesus is standing there with Pontius Pilate. And the crowd is yelling, let him be crucified. When have we been the crowd yelling those words in our everyday lives? We think about Simon the Serenian who's pulled from the crowd and willingly accepts the task of helping our Lord and Savior carry the cross. When have we helped our Lord carry his cross? When have we done our job to build the kingdom here on earth? We think about the centurion who boldly proclaimed, truly, this is the Son of God. But the story of love and redemption here is that in all of these moments, God still loves us. God still makes these steps of his passion to Calvary for every single one of us, for everything that we've done, past, present, and future. In all of these moments, God has loved us through it. Let us walk these steps of Calvary with our Lord and Savior. As our Savior overcame all of this to die for us and to ultimately rise on Easter morn, let us walk with Him, recognizing those moments in our life as we prepare, we make these final steps towards Easter to identify those moments in our life where we've been those people and bask in the love that is our Lord's sacrifice. As in the Gospel of John, it says there's no greater love than this than to lay down one's life for a friend. Jesus on the cross being the ultimate example of that. Join us in the great adventure of family at ilovemyfamily.us. We'll meet you this Sunday in the Eucharist. And the heart to the land deeply, God loves you. said Simon. Sugar. It was Peter. All right. Go, Marie. Yeah. Not assault your sister. One. Join us in the great adventure of family at ilovemyfamily.shoot. What is it? <laughs>